Hey, Box developers. I'm Alex, your developer advocate here at Box. I'd like to give you a quick demo of the new Box AI Platform API Metadata Structured Extraction Endpoint. Let's dive in. In this example, we're going to look at asking Box AI to grab relevant metadata about an invoice stored in Box based on a metadata template that has been previously configured in the Box Admin Console. You can also use similarly structured metadata schema objects. In the interest of being language agnostic, I'm going to do this demo using curl. But know that all of the Box AI platform API endpoints can be used via most of our SDKs. I'm going to use this invoice from Acme Plumbing Company as an example. In order to use the structured extraction endpoint, you either needed to have created a metadata template to input as a parameter or manually write out the schema. For this example, I'm going to use an invoice template I've previously created. To use the endpoint, you need four pieces of information. The template key, which you can get from the URL bar in the admin console. Number two, the enterprise ID of your box instance, which if you don't know it, you can grab it from the account and billing section. And a type, which in this case is metadata underscore template. Finally, you'll need the file ID of the invoice, which we can also grab from the URL bar. Now, if I copy-paste this command into a terminal and hit Enter, Box AI will return the relevant information it finds based on the template. Now, going further, I can then simply copy the response object into a subsequent apply metadata instance box API call and actually apply this metadata to the invoice. In this case, I do need to update the date to the appropriate box date format. And since the total is a number in the metadata template, I need to remove the quotes. If I run this command, Box will apply metadata to the file. If I reload the invoice in Box and look in the metadata tab, I can see that it's been applied. And that's how easy it is to use the metadata structured extraction endpoint. One quick note, you'll need to have the appropriate Box AI scope enabled in the developer console. Box AI enabled in the admin console for your Box instance, and a Box Enterprise Plus license in order to perform Box AI platform API calls. Thank you for checking out this video on the Box AI platform API. If you'd like to find out more, please check out our Box AI developer zone at developer.box.com. You can follow us on X at Box Platform, subscribe to our YouTube channel at Box, and check out our new LinkedIn showcase page at Box-Developers.